Let's set up the page. Choose the page resolution and click on create. Now from the toolbar select the text tool and write the text here. Drag it and make the size a little bit bigger. Place it at the center. Now let's increase the space. And rasterize it. After rasterizing, select the text, do right click and cut it. So this way we are separating the each text here. Now by using pen tool, by following the R here, draw a plant shape with leaf. And you can control the curve handle by using Alt key. Now let's close the shape and fill this with color. Let's delete the original alphabet. Now by using pen tool here also draw the curve so that it can match with the curve of the R. And complete the shape and fill this with color. Now rasterize it. Take this one little bit up. Now do right click and rasterize it to quick selection select the alphabet P press delete key and now control D and remove the selection and delete it and we made a shape here and rasterize this do quick selection go to select expand it because we we need to make a gap here for the gap here you need to change the value okay now select the alphabet O and press delete key, control D and remove the selection. And here also we need to make a gap. So by using rectangular tool, we'll make a gap here. Fill this with color. Now rasterize it. Do right click and rasterize it. Do quick selection. Select the down object, press delete key, control D and remove the selection and delete it. Now let's change the color. So double click over the layer and here we'll apply gradient color to it. So in gradient color option here you can pick your own color. And for this also we'll change the color. And here you can fix the gradient color. You can fix the angle like this. Or you can use direct value here, 90 degree. Okay. Similarly, apply gradient color to the other objects. And for this one, we'll make some changes in gradient color. Click OK. Now it is fine. Select them all and group it. Drag all the layers and group it here. And now open the mockup file. Check the description if you don't have this mockup file. Now double click at the top layer. Drag our transparent logo over the new mockup tab and leave it here. Yes. And drag it and make the size a little bit bigger and place at the center. Unmark this. Close the tab. Yes. And wait for the mockup to be applied. Hope you like this tutorial. Thank you.